I'm Charles Bankhead of MedPage Today, reporting from the American Society of Metabolic and Bariatric Surgery meeting in Orlando. Obese women with polycystic ovary syndrome had significant improvement in symptoms within a year after bariatric surgery, according to a small clinical series reported at the meeting. In particular, a subgroup of infertile women who were interested in childbearing successfully conceived within three years after bariatric surgery. Dr. Mohammed Jamal of the University of Iowa in Iowa City summarized the key results and discussed their implications. Our study looks at the impact of weight loss surgery, specifically in the form of the ruin by gastric bypass, um, on symptoms of the polycystic ovary syndrome. One of the primary features of PCOS is infertility. Um, what our study has shown um, by looking at patients over a nine-year period that almost all patients who desired pregnancy, who were in it, unable to conceive before the ruin by gastric bypass, as, and who were morbidly obese, um, were able to conceive within three years after undergoing the ruin by gastric bypass and uh, losing significant amounts of, of weight. How would you hope that um, physicians might interpret this particular information and, and act on it? So I think uh, our study and the few others that are done in this aspect, they provide the, um, the foundation and they are just the tip of the iceberg because what we are seeing is the clinical symptom resolution in these patients. PCOS patients who undergo gastric bypass tend to are able to conceive in almost all instances and that's a, that's a very um, um, uh, important finding in the few studies that have been done in this regard. What is needed at this point is to further collaborate um, in a multi-center effort and try and look at the long-term prospective analysis of some of these patients in a much larger cohort. And if you're able to support uh, our early findings that uh, PCOS, in fact, does resolve and respond positively in, uh, to gastric bypass and some of the other weight loss procedures, it can have a significant impact on policy making. And I'm talking about infertility being diagnosed and, um, uh, and defined as one of the serious comorbidities in patients who are obese and who have PCOS who may qualify for weight loss surgery. As of this, a lot of insurance companies uh, do not consider um, infertility in patients who have PCOS and who are morbidly obese as one of the criteria for allowing weight loss surgery. From the American Society of Metabolic and Bariatric Surgery meeting in Orlando, I'm Charles Bankhead, MedPage Today. Thank you.